I always believe you should only take advice from people who are doing it or people who have done it before. But sometimes that ain't always true, you know. I know someone, they want to manufacture their own product. Let's say it's a drink. My advice to them was take baby steps. Give out free samples. Build up a little customer base. Let people spread your product using word of mouth. See, that's not the be on end all. That was my advice, you know, maybe advertise on Facebook and start a YouTube channel as well to help market this product. This person's obviously telling other people about their business idea, their business venture. And they know someone who they dabble in businesses or whatever, and they made a lot of money. Yeah, older person, yeah, grown ass person. They made a lot of money, and their advice to this person was nah, don't start off small, don't take baby steps. You need to start off big. You need to market it like it's an exclusive, sought after product. You need to bullshit people. That's what he fucking said, you know. You need to bullshit people. When I heard this, I said, like, are you serious? I couldn't believe it. I, I couldn't believe that someone who is in business and who's made a lot of money doing this and that, whatever, would give advice like that. Either they're fucking stupid or they I don't know, however they came into money isn't through businesses or whatever, and maybe they lied, I, I don't know. But what type of life mentality is that? That is not my life mentality. And that's people's problems. Too many people are in a rush to go through the finish line. No one wants to put the fucking work in. Everyone wants quick results. You ain't willing to persevere. You have no patience. When I used to, um, when I first started this YouTube channel, and I still do now, every now and then, I watch videos on YouTube about how to get more subscribers and how to up your views and stuff. Because obviously I don't know it, obviously. And I might be missing out on some key things. And that's why I ain't getting that much views and subscribers or whatever. Right? But every now and then I'll see some videos and they'll do Give the worst advice ever. Join Facebook groups and send your videos into the Facebook groups. Now, they're not telling you to join Facebook groups that are relevant to what you talk about in your videos. No, just join Facebook groups and spam the Facebook groups. Go onto people's videos and leave comments like, oh, can you give me a shout out? Can you subscribe to me if I subscribe to you? Or they leave their fucking, their YouTube channel link in people's comments. Or they go on Instagram and they pay people to give them a shout out and all this type of foolishness. That cannot be your life's mentality. You will fail. Simply because you have no patience, you have no perseverance, you have no passion. You're lazy. You want quick results. There ain't no quick results when it comes to success. Put the fucking work in. That's the only way you're going to achieve something. I don't, like some people, oh yeah, some people get lucky. No, fuck them. I don't care about getting lucky. I'm not expecting to get lucky. I'm expecting, man, I put in the hard work. Man, I grind it out to reach success. So I don't mind if it takes me three, four, five years to build up a good YouTube following and make money. I don't business, I'm willing to put in the work. Anyone wants to listen to advice like, yeah, bullshit people, like who the fuck even talks like that? Bullshit people. 
Why, why would you want to lie to people? Now, the product is a good product. And you could believe the bullshit about it's an exclusive sort after product. Yeah, you could believe it. But is that how you really want to go about it? Come on, man. There's a pride in when you become successful. You don't want to become successful because you lie to people. Nah, you never cheat. Never cheat. You're only cheating yourself. You will only get so far with that type of mentality. My advice to someone who, if you got, imagine you, you got a product right now. Imagine you want to start your own little, I don't know, make your own coffee, your own kind of drink. My advice would be give out free samples, build up a little customer base, get people to share your product or talk about your product, you know, word of mouth. Start a fucking YouTube channel about making different kinds of drinks and stuff. Obviously, don't put your product in there because people can steal your idea or whatever. But make a YouTube channel about maybe making drinks and or tasting drinks or whatever in it. Something to do with drinks and food. Once you build up a good following after a couple of years, I don't know how long it's going to take. Then use your product, advertise your product through that YouTube channel. But people don't want to do that. Nah, because I might have to make 150 videos and I can't be bothered. Exactly. That's why you can't be bothered. Lazy. You want quick results, then clicks. You want quick results. No quick results out here. No quick results. You think, you think I'll be joining Facebook groups that have got nothing to do with what I talk about and I'm going to just Upload my videos into the Facebook group and 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 spam people. No, all I use, I upload my videos from my YouTube channel onto my Facebook. If you want to go and look at it, you can. And sometimes I don't even like uploading my videos onto my Facebook page because people will just click it for two minutes or one minute and then just click off. And then what's the point? What's the fucking point? But anyone. Don't listen to any advice like that about you need to bullshit people. If you listen to advice like that, you're looking for a quick fix. And this is the problem with a lot of people in the black community when they start a business. They just want to, oh, sorry, both times this time. They want a quick fix. That's why you see these Caribbean shops open up for a couple of years, then bam, shut down. You're like, rah. That man, they barely hung the sign outside the shop and they already shut down. They want a quick fix. They're not really willing to put in the work. Put the fucking work in. Make 150 videos, 200 videos. You've got to. You think, see, this is the thing, yeah? People think people like Drake and... All these people just pop out of nowhere and they're famous. Bro, man, like Stars P, mixtape after mixtape. Only now and then people get lucky and they blow up after one song. Don't try and be that person. Don't try and, you know, get lucky. I would love to wake up one morning and fuck, I've got a million views on that video or whatever, innit? It don't work like that. No well, like you see man like King Richard, but my man got like 650 video man still making these videos. Most people they gave up. But that's why whenever you do something, you need to have a passion for what you do. You have to enjoy it. That way, even when you ain't even getting the results that you want. You don't mind, because you're like, you know what? I enjoy what I'm doing. Now, I'm going to release a video, maybe, I don't know, today or tomorrow, it don't matter. You're going to see it after this video comes out. It's about my motoring experience or whatever, isn't it? You know, it took me pretty much two and a half, three days to make this video and edit this video. And I think to myself, three days, you know, I ain't getting paid for it right now. But I know one day, in the long run, I'm going to get paid for it. 
Yeah. It might not be through YouTube. People might see the video. I'm putting that energy out there. People might see the video or see our videos. Feel, yeah, let's get this guy on TV. You never know. One day I might have my own fucking TV show. You think Jeremy Carl knew that he was going to have his own TV show when he was 20 odd or Steve Walker or Jeremy Springer? Well, you know Jeremy Springer was a fucking lawyer before, you know? You put in the work, great things come. You don't put in the work. You want to be lazy. You want to have this short type of mentality thinking, oh yeah, man, just bullshit people and all that nonsense. You ain't going to get nowhere in life. You will fail. That's why you see so many people starting stuff and then they just give up straight away. Because they're looking for quick results. Put the fucking work in. Stay wise.